The WPF grid control allows you to edit cell values using in-place data editors. In this video, I'll show you how to implement this. First of all, we need to enable the column's editing values. Change a couple of properties and we're ready to go. Now the grid control automatically creates an editor for a column based on its value type. As you can see, the grid control displays the date edit for date time fields and text edit for numeric ones. Use the column's edit settings property to specify an in-place editor for a column. Let's replace the text edit control with the progress bar. We also can select the template that defines the column cells presentation. Use the cell template property to change this column's editor to the track bar edit. The grid control allows you to use separate in-place editors for data presentation and editing. Each column provides cell display and cell edit templates to define custom editors that display and edit custom values. Now let's take a look at the progress column. Let's use the progress bar edit control to display values and the track bar edit to edit them. For this, the progress column uses the progress bar edit editors to display data. When I focus cells, the track bar edit editors will replace the progress bar edit. After specifying a couple of properties, our grid control is ready. Now progress values look nice and I can edit them fast and easy. To learn more about the grid's in-place editing, make sure to click on the link provided in the description. And that's it for this video. If you'd like to learn more about our WPF controls, you can watch more videos from our playlist or check out the documentation on our website. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for all of our latest content. Thanks for watching and thank you for choosing DevExpress.